So for finishing a pick, you just want to have a file or a wire brush or a deburring wheel on your grinder, something like that, so that just that you can kind of break the edges and remove some of the worst of the um, of the additional material left on there. So I'm just going to run this along our file for a second. This really is just for the roughest stuff. And you can also then use this to shape corners where the grinder couldn't really get at. But I'm actually pretty happy with our initial shaping here. So I would spend more time on this, but I just want to get along to show you more about the finishing process. Get yourself some wet dry sandpaper. In particular, you want something that goes through a series of grits so that you can get ever and ever finer on the pick. I'm just going to start off with a really coarse 220 grit here. And for this first piece, I'm just going to wrap it right around the pick. Alright, so even just with the 220 grit applied, this is already dramatically smoother. If I were to put this in a lock right now, I'd be getting pretty good feedback, but I'm going to go ahead and move on to some even finer grit so that I can get it as smooth as possible. I'm moving on to a 500 grit. All right, getting smoother and shinier all the time. Now we're going to bump up to a 1000 grit. Oh man, that's uh that's feeling a lot nicer. There is still some pitting on the pick, which you can see from uh, bad strikes when I was grinding. This is mostly just because I was moving a little too quickly as I made this video. Now, I would typically go on to even a 1200 grit as well, and I would have spent longer on each of those stages than I did. But I'm a little anxious to open a lock with this, so I'm going to grab a lock. We're going to pick it open with our brand new pick. All right, so now we're going to use our new pick and our new tension wrench in order to pick our first lock. I'm going to apply a little tension with my top tensioner and go in here with my hook. Boom! Open. Now, this is just a two-pin lock. I just wanted to show you that these tools are entirely usable. Alright, now on to bigger and better things.